What a beautiful sound. We are just under 40 days away from the first pitch being thrown out on the Blue Jays regular season. And the boys in blue had their first full workout as a team Tuesday in spring training. And it involves stretching, more stretching, some stretching, and yes, more stretching. <laughs> Of course, they ran some drills, and this year will be a unique season because there's a number of new elements from bigger bases to new rules involving a pitch clock. I think it's going to be an evolving thing. I think most guys handled it fine. Um, it was nice for us, I think even as coaches, to see it kind of play out in real time a little bit, um, not perfectly. Fans lined up in Dunedin, Florida to take a glimpse of some of the fan favorites from Vladdy to Bo. This marks the first spring training under manager John Schneider, who replaced Charlie Montoyo, who was fired mid-season last year. The main messages were kind of, you know, look around the room and look at what, you know, we've assembled here and it's time to take the next step. Tying run at first. Swing and a fly ball center field coming in Julio. He makes the catch and the ball game is over. The Jays are looking forward after an epic collapse in the playoffs against Seattle after blowing an 8-1 lead in game two of their wildcard series to end their season. When you go down to the wire like that, you realize just a half game or all these games, that they all add up. So um, obviously after the bittersweet loss, I mean, it's you take some time to reflect. And, you know, this team has, has really been talented, but I think it's more talented now this year. In the offseason, they added a number of new faces, including two-time World Series champion Brandon Belt. I'm super excited about being here. For one, I've heard and I've met a bunch of the guys, and I've heard that they're, this is a great group of guys. So uh, that's awesome for me. Um, that's going to be great for our team. And on top of that, we're going to have a legit chance to, to win a lot of games. So I'm excited about that, too. Vladdy Guerrero Jr. won his first Golden Glove Award last year, and at the beginning of the season of 2022, he said that fans were going to be in for a movie, clearly not knowing the epic collapse they would have in the postseason, but his words for this season? Uh, this year I'm not going to say anything. I want you, you guys got to watch it. Your first chance to watch this new Blue Jays roster is this Saturday in spring training when they take on Pittsburgh. For City News, I'm Lindsay Dunn.